Let's start up a new document using an Illustrator file. So this picture right here, I just wanted to show off. It's one of my students, Brielle Mays. She made this really cool image of mental, managing stress in healthy ways. Just an example of something that you can create in Illustrator. So if you're creating a new file, you're gonna go up to File and select New. Then this dialog box will pop open, allowing you to choose all of these different preset options for creating your new file. So I'm going to click the print option just to start there and show you something that might seem familiar. We have this letter preset. So that's going to be eight and a half by 11, just a sheet of paper. The legal page will be eight and a half by 14, um, different size. So you choose whatever size that you're comfortable with. The default unit of measurement in Illustrator is points. But if you click this option, you can put it to a different, more familiar um, unit of measurement. So if you do pixels, pixels is the default unit of measurement in Photoshop. If you do picas, that's the default unit of measurement in InDesign. Or you can just stick to inches or centimeters, something that you're more comfortable with. So you'll see this again, eight and a half by 11. The legal, if we flip to that one, that's eight and a half by 14. So just some different options. So I'm gonna switch to inches and I'm gonna title this template. See, whatever name that you put in the preset details is going to be the name that it names your file. This does not necessarily mean that the file is going to save, but if you do save it, that would be the saving name. So then we have our margins, our bleed. That's how much the printer is going to print outside of your margins. We have the top, bottom, left, right. And then if we click advanced options, you can go down to your color modes. So because I clicked print, it went to CMYK, which is the default color mode for printing. It's putting in me with a high resolution 300 PPI, which is points per inch. And then it's just gonna do the default preview mode. So what you really need to focus on is what size you want your artboard, the unit of measurement you're using, and then if you want it landscape or portrait, I'm gonna give you two artboards just to show you what that might look like. Okay, so here is my, here are my two artboards that I've created in Illustrator. One other thing about setting up your document that you might want to see is the rulers. So how you do that is go to view and then you'll go down and it says rulers and then click show rulers. Now next to everything in this view panel, you'll see all these keyboard shortcuts indicated to the right. So rulers is actually control R, that's the default. So we say my rulers. Now let's say I'm doing this and I know it's eight and a half by 11, but I really want to practice using points. If I right click on my ruler, I can now change what unit of measurement I want to use when I'm creating my file. So there we go there. You just set up your first Illustrator document.